Depending on where you were in Ohio Tuesday morning, you could have experienced moderate rainfall or frost. Yeah, that's right. Big variety of weather in Ohio Tuesday morning. As you can see on our national map, high pressure located over West Virginia, clearing the skies in the east from Ohio, northeast Ohio. Overnight lows dropping to the upper 20s, low 30s once again. But we have a warm front located out here to the west across the lower Ohio Valley into the eastern Mississippi Valley. That's lifting ever so slowly northeastward. You can see a line of precipitation that has developed along and ahead of that cool, there are warm front. And as the old saying goes, never trust a warm front. You can see that is a fairly solid line, very thin, but it's solid. And that's going to pester southwestern Ohio and southern Ohio for a few days to come because things are starting to back up in the atmosphere and not moving along very quickly at all. The local map shows temperatures ranging from 30 degrees in Youngstown and New Philadelphia, and or 32 degrees that is, to 52 degrees down here at Cincinnati, so a big temperature difference across the Buckeye State. Speaking of which, the forecast for Ohio, the Travelers forecast during the day Wednesday, along and south of I-70 is where your best chance of precipitation is located. North of I-70, you should have partly sunny skies. There might be a stray sprinkle here and there, but if you get one, don't be too alarmed about it because you're not experiencing or expected to experience what they are in the southern and especially the southwest part of Ohio. With that in mind, let's take a look at your official National Weather Service five-day forecast. So we might be in a log jam in the atmosphere, but one thing is for sure, our temperatures will remain consistent during the next several days. Highs in the 60s, lows in the 40s, it's just about normal for this time of year.